is warm, and in fact, it's just going to be hot later on today. We'll get to our weather in a second. Want to update you on the tropics. We are looking at Tropical Storm Karen, which isn't a well organized tropical storm. It looks pretty impressive on the satellite perspective here, but as we zoom in for a closer look, a lot of this storm activity isn't right around the center of circulation. It's kind of displaced a bit. So, maximum sustained winds only 45 miles an hour. It's really barely a tropical storm. Tracking to the north northeast for now, but this storm is going to be a little weird over the next few days. It continues to go to the northeast, turns east. Okay, we've seen that before, but watch what it does tomorrow and tomorrow night. It turns around. It weakens to a tropical depression because it's going to keep basically trying to feed off of the same ocean water that's progressively going to be cooler and cooler. It's using up its own fuel supply. And as it tracks back over its own path, it's really going to use up that fuel supply. So weakening even further by the back half of the weekend. By Sunday morning, the storm is basically going to be where it is right now, but with much weaker winds and even less organization. It continues tracking to the west. We don't want to see that because this kind of track would eventually take it closer to the Bahamas or the east coast of Florida, the southeastern coast of the U.S. But a lot of the forecast data indicates this won't even be a tropical depression by this point. So things are heading in the right direction. We're watching it. We're not worried about it. Let's take a look at what's happening a little farther out in the tropics. This is Hurricane Lorenzo, obviously a much more impressive looking system. This is a Category 4 hurricane. has 130 mile an hour sustained winds around that very well-defined eye, that center of circulation. It's expected to hold on to this strength for about the next 24 hours, but as it moves to the west-northwest, it's going to turn north, and that's going to take it eventually over some cooler water, and the storm is gradually going to weaken as we head into the weekend. Still a major hurricane as we head towards Sunday morning down to a Category 2 hurricane by Tuesday, but this is out over the middle of the Atlantic Ocean. Shipping concerns, obviously, are going to keep a close eye on this storm and avoid it, but the next chance it has to even maybe impact line is going to be that Azores Island chain. It's going to be about the middle of next week.